maximize that F1. Your mouth extra wet. That's where I'm at right now. I'm trying to get my bearings, but oh, I'm not watering. It is Monday night. I know I look kind of weird. Anyway, <laughs> y'all see me at my worst. <laughs> Today's Monday. April, I said April. God, dog. May 8th. And it is the start of a new vlog. It is the start of a new week. I, you know, I don't know if y'all are if y'all knew, but last week in my last week's or two weeks ago's vlog, I, um, Jamima and I went to Allen to get our ears pierced, and literally this past weekend, um, eight people were killed and seven wounded in a mass shooting that happened at that exact outlet mall. So, like, it's really just been heavy on my mind and my heart. Uh, you know, a um, six-year-old boy was left without a family. He was left an orphan. And it's just heartbreaking that it's the fifth, year, it's the fifth month of the year. And the United States of America has already, has already been witness to almost 200 mass shootings. That's... That numbers, that statistic alone should change everything. Should, should change the trajectory of everything going on in this country. But with capitalism, with fascism, no, I'm not going to get into politics. It's just, it's a new week. And, you know, you have to be thankful. And, we, and the, the thing about life is that it moves on whether tragedy strikes you, someone you know, or nobody at all. So, just, you know, my, my heart and my mind have been heavy with just life things. And, um, but that is not the reason why I'm out on the town today. My friend, she, who is a flight attendant, she is in Dallas for the night. And, you know, usually, well, 99% of the time, I do not. I don't care when you're in town or when you're not in town, but... I do want to take this time to just see her real quick. Um, so, I'm on my way to go and get her. Have y'all seen her in my vlog before? I think you've seen her in one of my vlogs before. Um, when my, my friend, she was having her birthday party in March. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I mean, if you, I think going forward, everybody you see within around me within my vlogs you're gonna they're gonna be repeat people i don't hang out with too many new people i need to i need to just to because i don't have new friends i think jamima is my newest friend and we met almost three years ago so you know i i need to make new friends but um it's hard making new friends in adulthood it really is. People don't talk to you. People don't tell you how when you grow, when you get older, like, I still feel like a child. I still feel like a teenager. I still feel like I'm learning so many things, so many basic necessities to navigate through life. I feel like I'm still learning them at my big age. And it's unbelievable to me how unprepared I am for adulthood while I am living right smack dab in it. Like, I am almost considered a midlife, a mid-level adult. 
30 is not old, but it's certainly not young. When people, when you be like, how old are you? Oh, 30. Hmm. I'm 31, 32. Mm-hmm. Are you still doing that? You know what I mean? It's, it's to the point where, like, if you say something crazy online, people will be like, you're 30, you know? Now, it hits, it hits, you're 21. Nobody, nobody, you're young, but you're 30. Like, you know, it, it hits different. And so, I think it's every day I just, I'm just so confused and so in awe about how much I do not know while I am one third in this thing. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like making friends, uh, what else? Financial literacy, navigating through hardships, navigating through friendships. As friends get married, as friends have children, get houses and move further away, how to navigate that, how, how to navigate your mindset, how to be like, it's crazy how you have friends and then no friends at the same time. How do you feel so lonely or how do you feel alone where you're also loved and you also love others? It's just a weird space to navigate. You know, it just could be me. But one thing I've learned in this life, it's not just you, baby girl. Your mind, your ideas, somebody must have, may have thought of them already. You know? Anyway. I always get on here and once that host start recording, I, once I see that red light, boy, I start saying shit. Oh, I also wanted to talk about, I'm not too deep in it, but... There's this controversy on TikTok regarding a woman named Brie, a woman named Fanita, and Tarte Cosmetics. And there's an argument going around that Fanita wasn't, um, she took advantage of the invitations from Tarte because she's not usually discussed in uh, makeup industries like that because makeup is not her niche or her forte. And she's hard to be marketed because she's vulgar in her speech. And I like Fanita. Um, so it kind of it kind of made me reflect on myself like, damn, you know, people are on her head for accepting this when they when she saw how they treated another black creator. However, on the other end, she is barely offered opportunities such as that. So why wouldn't she take it if she was asked? And I think as somebody navigating through content creation as someone who is not easily marketable, whether aesthetics wise or verbally, I, I see both sides, you know? Um, not all money is good money, but when you're, in, when you're in a field like this, a competitive, saturated field, and that's also kind of new. You know, content creation is still very, very new. Um, when you're in that kind of lane and then you're also not easily marketable as your counterparts in the black community and as those that are not black, it's hard to kind of, you know, assess the situation when finances are on the line or a new opportunities on the line and you're not represented by a marketing or a marketing firm or agency. So it's a lot of different variables within that. That kind of made me reflect on myself as a new or a small content creator, you know, that's only focusing on YouTube, you know, when, when I have to focus on both or all three, YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok, and how to kind of stay authentic and genuine while also becoming more marketable to have those um, opportunities of uh, brands and sponsors hitting my line, you know? But I I think, as a new influencer, there are ways to be marketable um, within and understanding that there's influence in, there's influence in authenticity. You know? Something else to think about, but I'm rambling. Let me go get my friend. It's nice out here. I ain't never been to no art park now. It's kind of nice over here. How's the operation on Monday close? Okay. Monday close.
Okay. It's kind of nice. Oh, that's where some dang good Chinese is. Okay. I look like a stalker. How did, how did they get in there? Oh, I got to go around. So it's not really closed then. I might want to live in Trinity Groves. It's real nice over here. I know this bitch gonna make me wait. I know it. How long is here? How long is video? Two minutes? It was interesting conversation. Yeah, I mean, like, well, the whole time, so I just Just cut it, you just not. Come on, fuck her, fuck her, come on. <laughs> then we'll come here on the Monday next time. I did that last spring. It's the best time I've ever done. See? Yeah. By far. Like yeah. the best thing. I can't even begin to explain like how amazing. I I feel good, but it's the hard. I did it 35 days. Really? You did it? You tried to? Oh, nice. Nice. You were just doing it. Yeah, it was like my New Year's resolution. Okay. At least 35 days. I need a napkin. Cause this gum is gonna taste nice. You got a napkin in there? You good? Yeah. I need to do that. Though. I'm sorry. Thank you. Yeah, the smaller ones. To like three exactly. Oh, nice. That's what I plan on. Well, I have that at home. Just that. Let's do it again. This time I'm gonna drink it. What are you doing? <laughs> Please get that. I'm screaming. Come on, everybody, get on now. <laughs> you got the picture? It's a video. Oh. Are you gonna pull a piece? Just for aesthetic purposes, I'm not eating this. Are you ready? Yes. When your friends support your content creation, they're telling me, am I ready? The day that comes after Monday, it's Tuesday. And then I when I say I'm going to get my hands done today, you should know that it's Tuesday. Okay, I said the day that comes after Monday, that's Tuesday. And when I come about that, oh, best believe I got something to say. It's Tuesday. Oh, baby, we about to go all in the self. We already went to go up in the mouth. And then when I drop it down, I want you eat it. Eat it up and clean it up with your teeth. It's Tuesday. I said it's one. I ain't got shit to say. What's really good, y'all? It's Tuesday. Another day, another dollar. I'm over here looking like a shaggy dog. But that's okay. Because that's the wig that I had out, and that's the wig I'm finna use. So we are on our way to do a couple of errands right now. I want to. So. The week before last, I um, put some clothes, I gave clothes away to Plato's Closet, but I forgot to do the shoes, so this time I'm going to do the shoes, and then I'm going to a quick USPS um, drive, and then I'm going to go to the beauty supply store because I am going to Houston for Mother's Day. Uh, we're going to take our mom out to a little Brazilian steakhouse. I've never been to a Brazilian steakhouse. Not even Fogo de Chao. So, I'm excited. I hate driving to Houston. I want to kind of low-key take the bus, but I have things to do. So, I'm going to take my car. And um, I want to do something. I want to do a hairstyle that's really fast. Uh, being that it's becoming more hot. It's getting more summertime. I know that... I don't want to keep readjusting my wigs, you know? It doesn't matter how many layers of glue I put on. It doesn't matter how long I put the melting band. Once I start to sweat, 
that's all she wrote. So I want to go to the beauty supply to kind of find like a half up, half down situation and or a half wig that I can just use and I can just cover my hair at the top. Something really quick and easy, I believe. Um, but you know how that shit goes. You, you go in for one thing and then you come out with something else. Um, and I don't want to just do a ponytail because, you know, I'm quick to slap a motherfucking ponytail on especially 1B613, okay? But I kind of want to do something different for the occasion that's not too different, okay? That's, you know, easy. You know, I don't want to do... I was on YouTube looking at different styles, and I don't want to do crochet. I've done the crochet uh, half, up, half, half up, half down. And no, I don't feel like it. So I'm going to try to see if I can find something else. If not, then we'll just have to reconvene and kind of reevaluate what we want to do because I really don't want to wear a wig. And if y'all haven't been to Houston, Houston, not only is it hot, but it's hella humid. It is so humid. And the humid is, the humidity is heavy. What? Heavy. Heavy. So, uh, I just, I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to. And then the thing about it is, once I get to a certain level of hot, I start to get irritable. I start to become, I start to become a horrible human being. I lash out because I'm so hot. Bro, what the fuck? Dog, you moving slow as hell. Shit. Oh my gosh. Put some pep in your stuff. Those are the three things that I want to get done right now on my break and uh, hopefully it doesn't take too long uh, if not then I'll just I'll move it to the next day or try to do it after work but I don't like doing things after work uh, but yeah how y'all doing today my chin is chinning today how y'all doing today y'all feeling alright I know I look crazy I look crazy but also you know I wanted to give y'all more right I wanted to give y'all more. So, this is the this is my definition of more. It's Britney, bitch. I see you. style of this big. I low key want it, but I don't see the price on it and I don't want to be shocked. Okay. So I just came back from Play-Doh's, right outside of Play-Doh's actually. And I forget what shoes I had in there. I don't know, but I had like a few shoes from Ego, the Vans, a shoe, some shoes from ASOS and Shoe Deal. And they, they accepted the Vans of course because they were brand new. And I got $42. So, I mean, like I said in the last one, $42 is better than no dollars. No doilers. So, yeah. I'm glad. I've had them in my car for weeks, so I'm glad I um got rid of them. And the vans, the orange vans, like... One of them got lost in transit. So the van store, they sent me another pair. And so then they found them. And so now I had two. So, I mean, I got that one for free. So to sell it, you know, it was a win-win. Um, I just don't remember the other shoes that I put in those bags. But hey, 42 is not bad. $42 is not bad. Well, it's Thursday. Hey. 
brows done and she's gonna look fee well hey, it's Thursday and Ruka is once again back in the wind oh and she's singing at the top of her lungs so you know she's gonna come with the heat well I said it's Ruka coming in doing different genres I said it's pop rock R&B and hip hop opera it, it doesn't matter when or oh, where well, or oh, how or oh, why Ruka is gonna do it big and she's gonna do it so fly well it's Thursday I like that I liked that I did it's Thursday y'all I haven't been blogging I said I haven't been vlogging. I haven't been editing. I haven't been doing anything. Because I haven't been doing anything. Like, I've just been at home minding my business. You know? Having an attitude in silence. I haven't been doing anything all week. Um, nothing vloggable. I... I watched Guardians of the Galaxy this past Tuesday. It was a really good movie. I really liked it. I don't necessarily think I'm a fan of Chris Pratt. I think I was a fan of Chris Pratt in Parks and Recreation. And then really that's about it. They're making him out to be a heartthrob and I don't get heartthrob vibes from him. Hemsworth brothers get heartthrob vibes. I even enjoy Ryan Reynolds. I think Ryan Reynolds is uh, good on the face. Bradley Cooper, another guy that's a heartthrob. Who are these Who are these superheroes that they're trying to make heartthrobs? Give them to me, give them to me. Who are they? I know they've been trying to make people they're just not coming to mind. Anyway, he just doesn't do it for me. But outside of that, I really enjoyed the film. I did. Um, I saw my friend yesterday. We had some wine. My friend, <laughs> my friend Ashley, for some reason, we when we are to firecrackers, firecrackers, I don't know what it is, but she's the only one that like, I don't know, maybe because she matches, she matches the level that I'm on, but flames, bro, twin flames. Anyway, I saw her yesterday, um, and I just, that's really it, and then Monday I saw my friend Taylor and Rachel, that's really it, like, I just been doing nothing, so I haven't been doing shit, I've been, I've been tired, uh, I was telling my friend, like, I get paid just to be broke and it's unbelievable to me yes like i'm totally grateful i have literally enough to pay my bills but i don't have enough to enjoy my life yeah i take small pleasure in the enjoyment that i have when i see my friends and stuff but i'm gonna do more than that i'm gonna go shopping without a care in the world i want to travel without penny pinching every month like i want to do normal people things and have normal people vacations and have normal people PTO without being scared because the job market is out of there or um, just that in the third. I'm just, I don't, it's just, you know, I, I, I guess it got to me this week because I just didn't feel like doing shit. And that's okay, you know, not depressed, not, you know, just out of, in a funk or anything. I just, I'm tired. So, that's what I've been up to. Um, I am going home this weekend, so for Mother's Day. So I'm just going to go get my brows done real quick and then pack. But, yeah, I don't. So, again, I don't. I told you guys, actually. I think I told you guys. I, I think I found. Um, oh, I could do that.
can't do that. Oh! Why they do that? Sweet, sweet heavens above. And then now people don't know how to drive them out. Jesus! You imbecile! You big truck bandits! Oh! Oh shit! Am I going the right way? I'm so sorry. What was I saying? Yes. So I, um, due to sweat and humidity, especially going back home this weekend, I just don't want to put on a wig because I know that I'll, for one is going to slip. <laughs> and I don't want, I don't know why, but I simply do not want my mama. I don't want, I don't want to be adjusting my wig in front of my mama. You know what I mean? <laughs> I just don't, I don't, I don't want that vibe. So I'm going to attempt a... Uh, half up, half down. I found something that I think I'm going to like. That I think I can do a little bit of DIY with. I'm unsure if I'm really about that. But I'm going to try. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try. Yeah. Because in my mind, I think it's going to be cute. Um, I got, okay, so basically I got two ponytails, right? They're different type of ponytails. It's like, it looks like if you, if you, what's past tense? If you blow out natural hair and then you use flexi rods, that's what it looks like. And so I know I can just straighten my hair and then, um, put that as a ponytail, but then I can use one of the ponytails, open it up and then try to, um, make it a hub half up half down situation but the ponytail is not full so i think i'm gonna go back to the beauty supply store get another one and then instead of like putting that i'm gonna cut that shit off and then crochet it either that or i'm gonna see if they have crochet hair because that would be better too that would be better too hmm. we'll see But yeah, that's currently what I've been on. Just trying to be black, be happy, and mind my business. You know, it's just one of them days. Ooh. Are we up? Yeah, it's just one of them, them days, you know, just one of them weeks where ain't really nothing. I think mostly it'll consist of this weekend, hopefully. If anything, if at all, but I'll talk to y'all. Oh, I'm not watching where I'm going. Slipping past my ass. Always, always gives me issues. I use. I use this, I've been using this for all my life really, but uh, I think I'm becoming immune to it because I'm getting musty for real. So if y'all have some good recommendations on deodorants for fat bitches, please let me know because I need it. I do not need, the, the last thing I need is to be musty. That's the last. So if you know something that I don't know, let me know.
Y'all, yeah, so I went to Lotus. I'm still here, actually. Eating down. I got some catfish, and then I got the fully loaded <clears throat> Lao pack. Oh, my God. Spicy. Oh, this shit smells good. Mm, with the crack sauce in the bag. Oh, this shit smells really good. With some crack sauce. Drizzle that bad boy all over this. Mmm. Like I can't see. Mmm. -hmm. Oh. Oh. I don't remember them putting it in a bag. Putting the crack sauce in a bag, but instead of like one of those containers. Ooh, this shit look good. And it's heavy. Ooh. Ooh, that's hot. Mmm. Yeah. Yeah, it's tasty. Yeah, it's tasty. Let me taste this rice. They felt like working today. Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. I went in there because they got their own like um house made in-house lemonade and it looked good i was like how much uh let me get a lemonade one lemonade five dollars is your mother and i'll be paying five dollars for small lemonade not even 20 ounce lemonade are you crazy mm. Mm. 
-hmm. It's good. Last time I came to um to Lotus, I was unimpressed. I was like, damn. Every time like a good business goes commercial, it always almost always does quality of flavor. But that was in there working today. They was in there putting their foot in it. Mm -hmm. Let me take this corn. Soft and sweet. Due to my stomach, I can't eat comfortably in the car like I want to, but that was, that was solid. So, solid loud pack. We have Fat Tuesdays. It looks better now. Stop doing that. Gonna get us a dat dat. Are you vlogging? Yeah, I'm vlogging. Doing my job. Where y'all gonna see that? I couldn't. I couldn't. Mm -hmm. All right. He said that's the only ones we got. Right. <laughs> He's fun. Yeah, he. I liked him. Cheers. Could have known by the eyebrows. <laughs> People take this shit. You suck dick, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Dude. It don't taste like nothing. It's like liquor. Oh, that's liquor. You suck the shit out there. <laughs> All right. Shoot. All right, and then we're going to taste the... I got... Missy, what did you get? I'm with my little sister. Y'all not gonna see her though. Nah, peace, Bellini, and uh, eye candy. Okay, Doki Smokey. If y'all are real choppers, y'all should have seen my sister in a, um, not the vlog. She did a voiceover for me. <laughs> long, long time ago. Long, long time ago. Flames. This is delicious. <laughs> That was good. Okay, and then we got golden crust. We got we got um let's do jerk chicken. Jerk chicken beef patty. This you got the um spicy, spicy beef patty. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. in the patty gonna do it. Mm -hmm. They put this in next week. Mm -hmm. The daiquiri in the patty gonna do it. Mm -hmm. Because I feel better, you? Yeah, I feel great. Yeah. Yeah. 
You know, I love black people. You know, niggas, I love they gonna do it for me every time. Mm -hmm. They gonna do it for me every time. All types of black. Mm -hmm. Regular black, Jamaican. spicy black, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Caribbean, mm -hmm. African, mm -hmm. Latina. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I'm all a nigga. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm all a nigga. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. yeah. Me no black, no minica. <laughs> ne me? Nunca negra. Negra, negra, <laughs> nunca negra. <laughs> nunca. This is solid. Mm -hmm. Did I give you my body? Mm -hmm. Give it back. Let me taste the spicy Jamaican. I mean, the spicy good. beef. Nice. It looks good mm -hmm. as hell. The mm -hmm. one I just first tasted, it's hot. Damn. Mm -hmm. The one you taste first, what? The Jamaican jerk. Mm -hmm. It was good. Mm -hmm. But your question had no curry. But this in is it. the original. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was pale. Mm -hmm. I wonder why I did that. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, bust down. Mm -hmm. This the one. Mm -hmm. It's spicy. Mm -hmm. Got a little kick to it. Okay, Golden Cry. It's hot. It's just funny. <laughs> this is, there's this, um, there's, I don't know why it's funny to me, <laughs> but there's this skit by this guy named Lai yeah. Wasabi. Have you seen it? I love him. Which one is it? Which one do you think I'm talking about? I love all of them. Oh, let me show you the one I'm talking about. There's one where he was a cop. <laughs> That's the one I'm talking about. Yeah. I love he it. said, you're, you're not very funny. <laughs> hey, I dropped my bands. 2020 bands. Get out of the car. He said, you're not very funny. He said, what's your name? Lai, Lai Wasabi. He said, Sabinos. <laughs> he said, get out of the car. He said, I'm sorry, Robert. Kill LA. He said, Lai Wasabi. <laughs> 2020 bands. <laughs> he's he's not said, funny. He's, he's never made me laugh in my life. I said, what? That's insane. He said, don't let him leave. Oh. He has never made me laugh. Get out of the car. Get out of the car, Get out Get out of the car, car before I cut your head. <laughs> and you know, he's so tall. He's so tall. I know. I like... Niggas in trad does it for me. Oh, every time. Man, every time. niggas in trad? You could be a pop Oh, pop bastard. Mm -hmm. And you'll still be fine. Is he looking at us? No. This spicy, this mm -hmm. spicy one is the, the truth. Mmm, -hmm. God, I'm missing out. This patty dripping. It is. It is. It's so good. Yeah, definitely better than the Jamaican. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, there are these two ladies eating. And she take a bite. She eat a bite. She's like. Uh-uh. <laughs> I haven't seen it. She just starts dancing. And her other friends in the other corner. Dancing too? Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm so good at making dance. See, we just need a ride. A little ride, a little dot. A little patty. Mm -hmm. So all that. I don't need it. What are we off to? Back to the crib. I made my sister mad, so I got her a daiquiri. <laughs> Cause that's how you apologize. Like be for real. Can you pause the music? Press media? No, you didn't have to, okay. We taking our mama out to, um, first off, let me introduce the vlog. What's up y'all? It is Sunday, it is Mother's Day. I'm with my big bro. Uh, of course, he's driving because what? What? And we're going to take our mom out to 
Tejas de Brazil. Anyway, he looked nice. He got he got a shirt on. Dolly bought this. Very, nigga, no. What the fuck? Uh, I don't know. I got a shot for myself. I got a shot for me. Uh, okay. And we're life. waiting for our, our little sister and our mom to get into the car so we can leave. Our reservation is at 3. That nigga's always late. Uh, I never get to... to right in the back. Exactly. And the panorama, it, it hits different in the back. So... When I was doing my makeup, my eyes kept watering and it's ruining my makeup. Oh, there she go. Okay. Ah, she looks good. Is she wearing his? I don't know, but why is she walking? Yeah, like I think that? she's wearing ah. his. You know my shoes lands on you. Oh, mm, okay. Italian. You sitting in the front. My shoes lands on you. Okay, Italian mommy. I don't know who Lanzonia is. Oh. Hey, Italian. Oh, okay. Yeah. What's Italian? Italian shoe. Okay. Uh, like Louboutin, what do you call it? Oh, yeah, Louboutin, okay. Yeah, 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 I, I know Louboutin. I know Christian Louboutin. Oh, mommy, you jeweled yeah, out. This is nice. You like the purple one, purple one. Yeah, I ain't. Like. Happy Mother's Day, mama. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Mm. I, t I asked him if he was going to take her, but. She's not going well. Oh, okay. You know where you're going? Yes, I do. The city center. Memorial City, though. I thought... Just city center. There's only one Texas Day Brazil in Houston. Really? No, yeah. I think it's two. Oh, yeah, the one I... Yeah, I'm going to... Don't go to the city center. It's cold? It's cold. That's cold, oh. friend. That one. I think that... What is it? What's that? What are you asking hey. for? What is that? Okay, no, thank you. We don't eat pork. Nothing pork, I just say. We'll say to Yeah. I thought you said they have to bring a meat plate. Yeah, plate? Meat plate? Oh my gosh. What's that? No pork at this table. Thank you. All right, I'm with my siblings. Hey. Oh my gosh, are you okay? No, not yet. Not yet, sir. No, thank you. Bissy, our, our things are red. We have to turn it green first. And we want people to come this way. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Who's hot? The little one that said yes. Thank you. I'm already melting. That's cool. Yes, sir. No. Yeah, we in the building. Yeah, we'll I'm vlogging. Do y'all mind being on camera? Okay, y'all mind being on camera? I'm a vlogger. He's a vlogger too. How she know you YouTube? Huh? How you ain't know he had a YouTube? He don't even know how to say my YouTube. You posted hella hard, Cordero. I'm ready. I'm ready. Tell them who you are. Follow me. There we go. I got a YouTube channel too. The Black Rover. Yeah. You think the they can Thank you. Because I was like, you think they can hear you? Do you think they can hear you? Thank you. The Black Rover and Chop the Rocks. Follow both of them, okay? And, and Autumn Events. I am, mm -hmm. I am Spring Events. So You're Spring you. Events now? No. Yeah, I didn't walk this time. It was a joke, Ruka. Oh, I. And it was a joke, Rafa. It's a joke, Rafa. Not a joke. I need a finishing. Okay. I believe. What is that? Is that a GoPro? We both vlogging. <laughs> Wait, y'all pulling the balls out like tools. <laughs> Where my toolie? I'm 
I'm vlogging. I'm vlogging. How about I'm She's vlogging. vlogging. It's inception. Vlogging. Inception of the vlog. Yeah. I mean, no vlog, vlogging, no vlog. Yeah, While well, you vlogging, my vlogging. Yeah. Yeah. Tapping roof. roof. The black I rover. I'm famous. This is. Oh, I love this song. You showing your age. Oh, Daria. I'm that's old school. That's newspaper. She said, I'm giving Velma the orange and then my ponytail. I didn't take a picture. Don't put them crusty ass egg rolls. What kind of egg rolls is this? They drizzled the firecracker. We finna find out. Go ahead. Tell us what it tastes like. They Probably, um, Sriracha. No, or that. Oh, that's a crack song. That comeback no, song. No, that sounds good. Yeah. Boink. Boink. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no stop sign. Ain't no stop sign. He just down. He thinks we're going to get up and, and, and swing. Ah, thank you, Clarissa. I thought you were gonna tell me what I got. Yes. You got it. Oh, yeah, drink some of that. Yes, ma'am. I know, I thought this was a green tea. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. We're taking, we're taking some of that. Shout out to the graduate. Shout out to Clarissa. Come on, Taylor. Cheers. Look at you. Look at her. You look like a damn fool. Oh, Do it one more time. Do it how you were riding. Why are you are you returning? I think I'm myself. <laughs> and then he's why is Cordero walking like he's grocery shopping? He's browsing. He's perusing. He's, 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 he's not doing anything with gusto. He's not doing I'm yelling. Cordell, can you please push it for the content? Make it go faster. Cause he gonna get reckless. <laughs> that nigga started galloping. Cordell, run up. from your alma mater when you graduate from your school that they want to flex all the money that they got from you what the fuck is this when did we get a coach mega bus when when we get this and you just driving calmly i ain't never been in any one of these in my life we don't even have sports like that for us to just be having that on coach uh 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 uh